Writers Kung Fu, this is Louis London. Shout out to Black Nation Television, Louis London Hikari. Black Nation TV. Let's give the this people right a, a quick 4 on 1. Who, who's Louis London? Louis London, uh, it's, it's basically about Hikari uh, light. That's like the main thing that we're trying to push. It's like the modus vivendi, modus operandi. Um, light um, is also like the name of my EP, Hikari. It means uh, you know, enlightenment, knowledge, and a quest for like all things brilliant and whatnot, and sharing that. And, like I'm a student of that. Let's go. This like sort of reverence of light has been following me around. It's been like sort of this undertone of my entire existence, really. Um, but then this one time, I got this tattoo, and uh, it just so happens that I found out later. You know, when you get like these Chinese whatnot tattoos, and then you're like, wait, it means bullshit. Uh, in this case, it meant light, and it was crazy. Like when I realized it, I was like, wow, it's like this whole full circle thing. Uh, so that's when like I really started to like sort of, you know. Um, push that and whatnot and like believe that maybe maybe someone's trying to tell me something you know just pushing boundaries just like uh studying like uh, enlightenment really and that's just really about discovery and whatnot and that's like a theme throughout my music you know what i mean like i i explore and explore new worlds and like i'll, I'll never do like something i've done um, in terms of music i'll never once i know i can do something i want to you know, the next hardest thing, you know what I mean? It's about discovery, it's about enlightenment and whatnot. And I believe, like, it's a really strange message to, like, convey in music, but in terms of the South African, like, market particularly, I think it's something very new. This whole idea of exploring uh, new territory, discovery, it's a very new thing. People like to like, just keep it in. Yeah. In the midst of, uh, you know, me writing poetry, and actually me producing like music that I like and whatnot, and, like subverse and content and whatnot. I actually do include the group. I, um, I love the fuck. <laughs> as much as I can, you know what I mean? So that by the time you realize you're dancing, uh, it's like the same time you'll realize uh, you're actually thinking about what I'm saying, what's happening to you, do you know what I mean? My message is actually living through you at that moment. And by the time you're too busy like dancing and whatnot, <laughs> do you know what I mean? So it's like a trick, it's like a mind trick. <laughs> This is a, a, a writing-based uh, form or art form for me, uh, I think. As much as the musicality of the world is like really there and it's prominent, it, but I don't think it would be anything without the actual lyrics, do you know what I mean? Words and poetry and whatnot, and the, the message in me, and, like, and just the rhythm of the words themselves, you know, it's very important. So, yeah, I started writing poetry and then that evolved into writing rap. That evolved into writing literature and did a couple of stints, worked for Rolling Stone when that was still around and whatnot. And um, what else? Wrote short stories. And, like now I'm working on like writing little film pieces and whatnot. But yeah, I think I think the thing that makes my sound my sound is the fact that like I'm so careful and like conscious of like the lyricism behind it. Yeah, it's a really fundamental part of it. Louis London and my music.
think I think if it's one thing I want to be known for is just that the fact that like I changed um, the current situation because of that because of the fact that I actually give a damn about you know writing and actual content. So yeah, yeah, it's pretty much it's pretty much stuff you can like listen to listen to over and over and over again, and then the two hundredth time you realize, oh man. That metaphor is a metaphor, and a metaphor, and it meant that and whatnot, and and all of those concepts are like relatable. Do you know what I mean? Like no matter where you are, when you when you do hear something that's like sort of speaks to you, like you engage with it a lot more, and that's essentially what I'm trying to do. Yeah. The next joint, it's a drug. Some of you may know it. I think I've got two remixes as well on top of that, which makes it nine tracks. I'll, I'll go through the remixes first. It's um, a remix of Drugs by Spook Matambo. That was very cool. In fact, I just got that today. And I was bumping it early on. It's phenomenal. It's really just it's bananas. Like, I mean, I made the song and I was really trying to push boundaries when I, when I like made the song. Like I remember walking into studio and then uh, my boy Francis had uh, just mixed it and I was like, what would happen if you dropped all the instruments and just left the 808 and just the sample? We did that and then that's how that song like became like very iconic in its way and it's like very stripped and barren like style, do you know what I mean? Um, but beyond that, uh, he made it like something else. He threw some guitars on there, like he really made it something. So shout out to that dude. Um, also, I think I've got a, a remix of Unloving You Land, which is the single of Hikari, um, done by Yannick, uh, Petit Noir. Yannick Yeah, yeah. So, um, that's, that's going to be hard, I haven't gotten that yet, but like, um, it's going to be out soon. So, pretty much by the end of this month, that should be like all wrapped up nice, nice. Um, beyond that, I've got um, seven other songs that like I've written by myself, I think in the past year. I've been performing them literally everywhere and whatnot. Really refining them when you perform them, you learn something. You're like, hey, actually, this would be cool there. So that came into like play when we were doing the final mix. And yeah, right now it's it's really tight artwork that I feel like perfectly represents what we're about, what I'm about. You know what I mean? You know, should, should we drop the name? Look, your name's changed, huh? Yeah, yeah, no. Wait. Now, now it's Louis London, though, and I, and I feel like I should like say it, like a lot on radio. Yeah, it's L O U I L V N D N. Cause you were Louis back then, you know. Yeah, just, just straight up you. You know, did, did you go to London? No, I, I realized that I was born. Yeah. Actually, I discovered that I was born in East London. Yeah. So I was like, oh. Cool. Oh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So yo, from my power, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I've, got, I've got some homies in the crowd right now. <laughs> got some, got some you know? love homies. Cool stuff, man. So, so let's talk about the music, you know, because because I, I know you from way back then, and the, the sound that you had has totally changed to to what you're performing right now. Let, let's talk about your sound for someone who's not familiar to who Louis London is. What kind of sound would you describe it as? Well, at the moment, yeah, uh, it's, it's a concoction. It's a it's a incredible blend of like uh, really every genre that I've found myself interested in yeah. up until this very moment. Yeah. So like it's just it's it's really just influences and exploring like new worlds because yeah. one can get stagnant. So you need to just like progress and just mm. check out that land. Like mm. you hear something cool and you're like, whoa, I want to make something as cool as yeah. that. And then that's how it really progresses on like a face level. Yeah. Yeah. But um, I, I really had an interest for the guitar, so yeah. I just picked that up, started playing, and came up with songs. And, yeah. yeah. I was telling the dudes a while, like how I came up with uh, I'm Loving You Land, for example, and that was like my first self-produced, you know, self-composed song. Um, like I just had this constant kick. Okay, one of those dry kicks. 
this. Just, you know, just constant. And I was like, oh my God. You know, and it's crazy because like, uh, it's crazy to freak out just from like a kick, you know what I'm saying? It's just a constant kick, Louis, there's nothing to it. Like, how are you freaking out? I'm like, dude, dude, you don't understand. And then I threw on the guitar on top of that like constant kick. Cause I just like had this idea, I knew what I wanted to sound like. I knew it wanted to, I knew it had to be like this, this 1980s, 70s vibe, you know what I mean? I'm driving, maybe I'm in like Knight Rider, and I'm driving like kids, you know what I mean? I, I knew it had to be like that vibe. Uh, so yeah, I threw on the guitars, like you know, basic, and create a demo. I created a demo on like uh, Garage Band, even man. And then yeah, uh, once I had the idea, took it, took it, took it through to the to the boys and whatnot, and then replayed the guitar. And then we refine it. And then we get it like all sounding nice, nice. And yeah, that's pretty much like one of the processes, like on like a face value level. But like in truth, it. It comes from nowhere <laughs> and everywhere at the same time. Do you know what I mean? Like I actually have this crazy, crazy belief that there's like this crazy world right above my head and it like stretches forever. It's like a plane and I just like stick my hand up when I want something and I grab it and it comes down and it's like this beautiful either piece of literature or artwork or whatnot. Sometimes our relationship is a bit tough but uh, yeah, we've been good to each other thus far. Since I began with the Kari project and the Louis London project, everybody's like response has just been phenomenal. So yeah, I've had like crazy support. Like every show we do, um, everything we put out, it's just positive feedback. Like I literally haven't received one negative thing except for some person on Twitter for something. But I think she was looking for attention. But beyond that, nah, it's, it's been it's been great. It's been it's been a really positive affair the entire time. It was, it was a good interview. Awesome stuff. <laughs>